The narrative around this, Mike, yeah. is what is <clears throat> so interesting to me. Months ago, four months, Scoot Henderson was the best player by far. Recently, Gene, or Adrian Wojnarowski and Jay Billis of ESPN have both come out and said that if the Hornets want the best player available, they easily, most certainly, go get Brandon Miller. That is, <laughs> that's the narrative that has changed in the last, I mean. Like a week. Th yeah, yeah, 36 hours <laughs> it's changed. Yeah. That's not something that changes so dramatically. Like, you look at Vegas, Mike, it was yesterday. Uh, Scoot was the favorite massively. Today, Brandon is the favorite. So what do you say? You've talked to scouts, too. Well, it's interesting. First off, both guys not necessarily viewed as franchise players, but building block guys. Both guys have their weaknesses. Both guys are scorers primarily. In the case of Henderson, guys are looking to them and saying, you know what, he can score. He's not necessarily the best passing guard around there. And then here's the other thing. He's not necessarily a three-point shooter. I'm told the second he comes into the NBA, guys are going to be backing off of him and daring him to shoot that shot. To be fair, they said that about Melo, too. They, they did. And Melo is legitimately one of the best three-point shooters in the NBA.